This is the Geneva Shore Report coming to you from the Riviera Pier Complex or just next to it over here by Waterside or Harborside or whatever you call this, Elmerside. Uh, you can see they're taking a boat out right now. Uh, those boat geniuses from Elmers, young guys that certainly know how to pilot. What a, what a nice skill to pick up when you're young to have for the rest of your life about small boat piloting. I wish I had done so. But anyway, I, I, I have to buy a steel boat. Steel. <laughs> that, that works, okay? Then only the dock gets beaten up. Anyway, we are here on... It is Monday morning, July 15th, 2019. I'm Lisa Otto. John Lovkowski. Good, Good morning. morning. And we are here for the Monday morning news report. So, uh, hot summer day to start off our busy work week here in Lake Geneva. It is. But it'll be lovely. And we have meetings going on all week. So tonight is the Planning Commission meeting and the agenda has a couple of interesting topics. One of them is the banners, the downtown banners that are being utilized right now for for a... That's going to be on the... Uh, yep, they are going to have a discussion regarding the ordinance for the... That's on the downtown. City Council meeting? It's at the Planning Commission. The Planning tonight, Commission meeting. 6 okay. p.m. at City Hall. And that has been... Those banners have previously been used for... Um, events or yeah. different um, things that they want activities, to wear. Yeah. activities. That's what the city administrator right. changed. And he decided to redefine the word activity to include businesses. Yep. Yeah. So we're going to find out a little bit more about that and find out what people's thoughts are on that because I'm sure there's going to be some public comments oh, prior bet. to the, <laughs> the agenda being started. And then they're also going to be discussing the parking lot which is over on Madison Street, which is a dog kennel store, babysitting service for dogs. And it has been, it was the dog spot, now it's the parking lot. The two young ladies who took over the business want to increase the amount of dogs they're allowed to have on property at one time. But they had to get some paperwork finalized and some different signatures. And we'll find out what happens with that because it's in a residential neighborhood and a lot of the the neighbors to that building are not pleased with, well, the barking. So well, 40 dogs is a that's lot, a lot of dogs. residential area. Yeah. So, so we'll be um, we'll be at the meeting and we'll be sharing the results with you. Oh, and tomorrow night we get to see the presentation of the check from Restaurant Week. Yep. For the Alzheimer's Association. Right. And the Alzheimer's really Walk excited. is coming up soon. It is coming up in, in September. September. It's and a if you go to the theater, you'll see. The GSR yep, ad yes. in front of every movie. Yeah, I gotta check that out. Okay, Lisa is becoming world famous, or at least Lake Geneva, Lake Geneva famous, <laughs> which is sort of like world famous on a smaller way. <laughs> a bunch of pastoral Chinese are never gonna know you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> and we okay. had a press release from oh, Visit Lake did. Geneva last night. We, we have hired two, two new members. Yep. Yes, we have um, Diane, Diana Goodwin. Yeah. She is the director of marketing, and then Kathleen Clothier. She is the partnership manager. Yep. So two I'm new really members. Excited. Yeah, they have really amped things up over at Visit really Lake Geneva. Oh and well, Stephanie who could Clay. guess? I know. Stephanie. Stephanie Clay. Stephanie, well, all the way all up the hill. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Yep. Love Stephanie. She has some energy, spirit, oh. fun. Yeah. yeah, you you meet her and you just want to plug in. Yes. <laughs> I want some of that energy. Yep. <laughs> well, and then Lake Geneva has also been voted best road trip from, from Chicago. Chicago. Yeah. Well, that's so, a real distinction. We are just, I, know. I thought it would be I thought it would be Gary, Indiana would we win are, that one. We are winning a lot of awards though. We are. Yeah. It's been well. a good year for Lake Geneva. And then we have the Shore Path. Yeah. That is up for being put on the list for Wisconsin's 10 Best, right. Yeah. Right. Best places to visit. So, so yeah, we have a lot of great stuff going on. And then we have the steak cookout at the Warwick right. County Fairgrounds Wednesday night. So Rib Fest is over, but yes. the steak cookout is on Wednesday night. And then on Thursday here in Flatiron Park, we have music in the park and the band Unhitched will be playing. That's a big and one. And they're a big one. Yeah. A lot of people see and them. And coming up. is Princess Bride on August, August 7th. 7th. I can't wait. Right, right there on the Riviera Beach. They will be spraying for mosquitoes. Be or there, least, be square. Or at least I will. <laughs> I have a canister, a can. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure. We'll be some extra now. strength. <laughs> Whatever That's right. <laughs> Vinegar. Hopefully you <laughs> Yeah. All right. 
Okay, so we're gonna wrap it up, everyone. Enjoy your Monday, and we'll be back later today with more weather, road, and news reports. I'm Lisa Otto. Jen Lovkow. And it's Davis Shaw Report. Bye.